Hi, my name is Stu McNish. Recently I had the great pleasure of sitting down with Max Reimer, the Artistic and Managing Director of the Vancouver Playhouse Theatre Company, and we talked about this season's production of Tosca Cafe. It's this radical fusion of dance and theatre. It reminds me of the overcoat, and it has that same sort of magical feeling of following a story through movement. We've got, and talk about movement, we've got Rex Harrington coming in to do this. And uh, the theater is, the show is anchored by Vancouver players. And why I mentioned that that's significant is because it actually originates out of San Francisco. Nonetheless, they found our own Peter Anderson, who they've brought down there, who was the star of The Overcoat, now in this piece. And uh, they've added Dean Paul Gibson, and they've brought uh, some of the best dancers that they have in America, the, this is from the San Francisco Ballet, added all these great Canadians, and are uh, bringing this fantastic piece to, uh, to Theatre Calgary and uh, the Playhouse. So, considering your background as a dancer, when you saw this and thought about bringing it to Vancouver, what was it about the movement on stage that caught your attention? Because you're looking at it from a very trained eye. I think what I like is the passion in it. It's there's there's a sensuality about it. The leads, it's 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 sexy. It's set in a cafe that has all this history. That is well, you know, it could be any one of these great taverns and establishments. It's a place where people gather and and interact as people. So it's the sensuality that I was really attracted to. I felt that the I love a story in motion. And we have so many times we ask our audience to really ingest great words, but at times I think it's also important to ingest great visual impacts and, uh, and of course it doesn't hurt that this music is just the best. It's everything from Jimi Hendrix to Puccini and uh, all woven in this, uh, woven through this story to make sure the movement uh, has a rhythm to it. Sounds exciting.